How to Catch a Cold is a very well-written Disney short. This is from 1951, directed by Hamilton Luske. And this tells us the story of, well, how to catch a cold. And it's beautifully narrated. And I'm not actually sure who narrated it because that information is not on IMDb. If you do know, please feel free to let me know. But this tells us the story of how to catch a cold. And the film is um, sponsored by Kleenex. And there's this wonderful line that's don't pocket your cold and it's not something i ever thought of but obviously we live in a throwaway culture where we don't really use reusable handkerchiefs anymore but when i was younger and growing up i know my grandmother always had a reusable handkerchief and she'd blow her nose and stuff it up her sleeve and it never occurred to me how disgusting that actually is and keeping your germs in a little warm pocket in your in your or in your sleeve is not a good idea so the, the film actually provided some food for thought when i wasn't it wasn't expecting it to maybe food's not the right word there but of course we have our main protagonist who has the beginnings of a cold but instead of doing anything about it he goes to work, kisses his family members, spreads the cold, the cold gets worse, he feels worse, and we see how quickly germs can spread, and there's obviously some science in this about, you know, what a cold is and how a cold develops, and some good tips about mostly what not to do when you have a cold, and how, also how to not catch a cold, of course, um, things like not spending out time in the rain, um, apparently not sitting near a draft or an open window if you've overheated for example if you've been working out or dancing or exercising and then you go and spend time next to an open window that's apparently not a good idea which i'd never never heard of before um so that kind of you know made me think oh that's quite interesting so i didn't expect to actually you know learn anything from this but there are some things in this that definitely made me think huh wasn't expecting that so it's pretty good how to catch a cold is Beautifully narrated, by whom I'm not too sure. Very well written, of course. Very well animated. Definitely in the kind of Disney style of the 50s. There are quite a few other informational, educational videos they did like this in a very similar style. It's a little rough around the edges, but generally very pleasing and certainly quite quaint looking back on it now. Um, quite amusing and certainly educational. How to Catch a Cold was one that I, you know, I wasn't sure what to expect from it, if I'd get much out of it, if it'd be interesting, but I liked it. It's good fun. Nowadays it's good fun because it's kind of cheesy, but I think, you know, at the time it might have been quite interesting. And I would probably watch it again. I did find it to be quite fascinating. Definitely worth checking out.